Hi everyone. So in this greenhouse for Dr. Alamesson, the all NFT um, vegetable production greenhouse, we set up a pond to collect rainwater uh, through the roofing gutters of the structure, and uh, that pump, uh, that pond will also serve as our sump as well as our reservoir, where it will be filtered before going into the greenhouse. So we connected the uh, Rainbird uh, irrigation controller together with the uh, the Hunter pump start relay. So the, the idea is that um, on a timer, if we need to irrigate uh, each table, so that's the closest table, that's table one or zone one, second table is number two, number three, and number four in the back. Uh, that the controller, once you turn it on, I'll demonstrate how this pump start relay works. We set up the pump, the submersible pump inside of that pond on the master channel, this red wire, which is connected to the letter M over there. And then each of these, one, two, three, and four, correspond to the solenoid valves that are underneath the tables over there. So meaning to say, if you were to activate, let's say channel one, not only will it open up the solenoid valve there, but it'll also turn on the pump inside of the pond to make them work in conjunction with each other. So demonstrate that here. We'll go to water now. Can you see that? And then let's say channel one. All right, let's turn it on for a couple minutes and you'll hear a click from the relay, which is just this 24 volt wire, which activates the, uh, the switch in there and you'll hear the water rushing. There you go, so water is rushing out to the filter. And that also turned on the solenoid valve. And we got water here. So, now the water slopes down into the collection uh, drainage channel in the back over there which in turn goes down this uh, drain that we created it's a drain slash filter which water goes down from here and this is our sieve trap for all of the uh, sediments that uh, that fall out from the channel so we can collect that before it goes back into the pond and there's a there's, there's a twist off here that we can uh, use for maintenance and then the water goes back down here which then goes back down to the pond and you can probably hear it but we put a screen over it to prevent algae uh, from uh, blooming as well as letting the uh, reducing the temperature of the water yeah that was it